cool, I actually killed it. Hello survivors and welcome to We Who Survive. My name is James and this is episode 31 of our Lost World 2.0 run here. So we are gonna get started. I do believe I cleared my pack. Yes, I did. Okay, so we're gonna do some weapons upgrades. I bought a bunch of junk and I mean that literally. Not 100% sure how I want to prioritize it. They're gonna run out of screws or something at some point. I've been wanting to do this for a minute. I don't have a bunch of ammo for her right now, but we're still gonna finish uh, spray and pray. So throw an advanced receiver on that, take her from 30 to 50, almost double the damage. Um, very similar, we're gonna do over here on that new SVU sniper. We're gonna bump that to advanced and basically double the base damage on it. And then, let's see, this thing already has, oh, no muzzle, really. Okay, well, we got to give it a suppressor at some point. I'm out of screws, so maybe I'll actually, no, I think, I don't think I'd have anything left to go by. So, um, but I do know one more thing we can do, which is on the Exodus, we can add a heavy suppressor, which increases the range sort of drastically, and then actually gives you another point of accuracy. It's a little bit heavier, but not by much. I'd like to throw a suppressor on the sniper, but I guess for now, that's gonna have to be what it is. And I guess one more thing before I get out of here, I was gonna, thought we were gonna start the Brotherhood missions, but they're telling me we need to do more. So we'll go do that, the Monsignor Plaza one. And then I do have a level up, because on my way to Diamond City, I ran into one idiot, and it killed him, and since we were on the threshold there, it worked, so now I just gotta decide what to put it in. That's crazy, I'm starting to max stuff out, oh my gosh. Alright, maybe we'll finish off Cap Collector, or we got, oh that's right, Intimidation. Alright, we'll finish off Intimidation then. Now we're just like an absolutely terrifying presence, theoretically. I got my save, whatever. Here's my settlement save. And uh, I'm gonna get a move on towards Monsignor Plaza. Look for that flux sensor or whatever, I guess. And when I run into some action, I will clue you guys in. Alright, we're coming up on a new bridge to us, so I believe we're actually going to have some enemies to take out up here. There's one. Oh, he dropped. Let's go get his ammo. There's even more up there. 
Okay, I'm not so worried about that though. I'm just worried about crossing. I just wanted to show you that we were here and that I did this. And, uh, ooh. Where'd you go? We gotta bop him. Got him. Alright, so we do sort of know, though, that we are walking up on enemies. We only killed one. I, we only killed one, and I saw at least one more, so... See how this goes for us. Shouldn't be too bad. I have a feeling it'll be, like, down there. Two, three, four people. But let's see. Dang, dude, someone's popping. Oh, there's a terminal. Oh, that's just for the turret, though. Where's that other person I saw over here? Maybe they're fighting someone else already. Almost time for a new mask again. Oh crap, how many of you? Can't even see where I'm shooting. Did anybody get this dude? There we go. Alright, we're nearly at Monsignor. Okay, Raccoon City Police Department? No way. This is definitely a part of the Resident Evil mod. Uh, it's telling me, I guess, the flux sensor is in here somewhere? I don't know. I guess I have to get it in there. There's nowhere, it's just walls. I'm just being met with walls everywhere. Here we go. What was the point of taking that freaking perk for... The thing was straight in front of me. Okay, so it's just gonna be a zombie fest instead of a ghoul fest. I'm cool with that. And a turret fest, I guess. Okay, turrets no problem. Is our flux sensor in here? That would be real nice and easy, and then we can just get back where we need to be. Oh, there was some raider scums. They didn't make it. On Senior Plaza. Jeez, dude. These zombies are getting so ridiculously strong, it's ridiculous. It's just insane. They'll eat so many bullets. Or the clipping will take care of it for you. Cool, I actually killed it. Wow, that was really traumatic. A Sultron Succubus? Dude, what is that? I have never seen that in my life. Oh my god. Holy crap, Ada. What did we just see? I 
How am I everywhere else? Okay, I'm not doing too bad. But jeez, dude. That thing is evil. Look at that. I wish I had a save right before it or something. That would be great for a screenshot. Holy crap. All right, let's go inside and get our uh, sensor. Hopefully no more of those. I guess while I'm in here, I could take my mask off in case I eat any more damage. Dang, I forgot to drop off the, uh... Oh, I have two of these? I didn't know that. I could do a repair. I'm gonna repair then. Forgot to drop the duffel bag off, though. Poor chap, he, was, he got caught with his pants down, basically. That's, that, yeah, there was no, there was no coming back from that. All right, anything else in here? Ooh, what was that? Some sort of key, hold on. Oh, Monsignor Plaza key, okay. Here's our thing, right? Yeah. There's our flux sensor. All right, so after this one, we better be able to actually join the Brotherhood or like start the missions, you know? Next time I see Griswold, I shoot him three times. 
Oh my god, okay, maybe I should have grabbed... I'm gonna at least go back and grab that holotape to check out at a later time. Oh, it's a poetry collection. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, I do need oh, yeah. these cans. Yeah, give me your cans. I need steel. Okay, that was not good. Rad barrels. Okay, unfortunately the game crashed the first time I walked out this door, so we got some different loot. I had to run back through and redo all this real quick. But, uh, yeah. As soon as I went out this outside door, the game crashed. I heard rain, so it was definitely like a rad storm or something. I don't even think I had to unlock it the first time. I think it was just unlocked, so this is really weird. Hey, this time no crash. Isn't that lovely? Alright, so where did we come out at? Not too bad. Alright, and we're not very far from Cambridge Police Station. Maybe I'll go check out this Monsignor subway and see where this takes me and how. I'm interested if it's a real subway like with the mods now or if it's just what it always was. Oh. No, I think it's still just the subway you have to fight your way through. Yep. Ada? I'll find you. That was a close one. Are you going to do anything? Oh crap. Could not see that little lady. Dang, legendary machete. Too bad we don't be doing no melee. Alright, well... I thought I was checking out a subway for travel purposes, but that is not what it is. I didn't think about it until I'm coming up to the door and I'm like, wait a minute, there's normally a Monsignor subway, so yeah, that is what it is. Oh man, look at all this though. Aluminum, steel, aluminum. Okay, I definitely need all of that. That's beautiful, so that worked out well. Uh, and then I think otherwise we are still going to go check in with the Brotherhood and see if we can get moving on that. Too novice. What we got back here, boys? I do need your desk fan. I need screws. All right, let's go see the Brotherhood. I'm not so worried about the novice frickin' safes. Zombies! Always gotta be some random zombies somewhere, man. They may eat a lot of 10 millimeter, but they never eat the same amount of 308. I do know that. All right, cheeky little level there. I'll take it. Okay, you know what? I find this interesting. Awareness. Time slows down by 30% for five seconds, but the more interesting is rank two, which is 50% for eight seconds. That could be extremely useful. I've never taken anything like that. So for the heck of it, to see what it is and if it's any good, I'm gonna use it. I hope it doesn't constantly like yank me and make stuff annoying, but we'll see. Nest entrance? I guess that's gotta be this big building, right? 
No, that's probably the hospital. Oh, demon tigers. Those are big ones. Holy crap. Oh, here we go. Alright, that was pretty interesting because it let me know I was in combat before I even knew I was in combat. Yo, these zombies just eat the 10 mil. You can't use that. Okay, lesson learned. Yeah, we may have some trouble, alright. Yo, these things are getting so strong. They are just giant bullet sponges. Oh man, they killed the night strikers back here. It looks like. Uh, where is that middle group with the legendary? I don't, I don't know where they went. Oh, packed, stuffed right leg. All right, that's an interesting one. Missed a bottle cap. Oh well. Okay, can I get to the police station now? That was so many zombies. Alright, I'm here with a turn in. You got that tech yet? Yo, here it is. Good job. Hope it didn't give you any trouble. Here, tech yeah. will always be in demand. Report back to me when you're ready to head out again. Yo, just give it to me. Locate the tech. Kill. Affirmative. Perfect. You've got the area on your map. What do we got? Can I join yet? If you find any technical documents, hang on to them. They might prove useful once reinforcements arrive. Okay, I think here is where I fudged Fort Hagen. I think you have to leave using this elevator. And then we should get the Prid win and we should be able to start the Brotherhood stuff. I am such a goof. Yeah, here we go, boy. Now we're gonna get our Prid win. There she blows. People of the Commonwealth. not interfere. Our intentions are peaceful. We are the Brotherhood of Steel. Sick. That's what I wanted this whole freaking time. Repeating. This is Paladin Dance on frequency 95. All Brotherhood of Steel units are to return to the Cambridge Police Station immediately for reassignment. Oh yeah, boy. They want us now. All right, we're all the way out here, but I'll have to figure that one out. This is Paladin Dan. All right, Dance Man, I need you to take me to the Pridween. Cavalry's arrived, and it looks like they sent in the big guns. Yeah, that's right. All right. Um, all I want to know is when I can get up I there. I felt the same way the first time I saw it too. We call our ship the Pridwin. She's loaded with enough troops and supplies to mount a major offensive. 
If she's here, Elder Maxon's here. And that means we're going to war. Ooh, she's going to be a quick war with that thing on our side. That's the plan. If history's proven anything, it's that an overwhelming show of force has a chance of halting a conflict before it begins. That being said, you're about to get to know the Pridwin up close and personal. I've received orders that we're both to report to her immediately. Follow me up to the roof of the police station. We're going for a little ride. Alrighty, people. I think this is about where I have to end the episode, but let's go, uh... Let's at least take the ride, huh? Don't you have some trash to hunt down? How do I get to the roof? Isn't that back here? Oh, yeah, boy. Alright, so... I'm not sure if I'm actually going to hop in because I actually grabbed some power armor from Fort Hagen and I have some other stuff that I need to drop off. So I might go do that before I hop in here with our boy Dance, but that is for the next episode. At least now we are started and on our way so we can go do some brotherhood things and some brotherhood things we will do. So sorry for the sort of weird episode. I, uh, I was wondering what was going on. Turns out I sort of broke the game. So at least that makes sense. Thank you for watching, hope you're enjoying the series, and I will see you in the next one. I'm such an idiot, dude. I am such an idiot. I knew something was wrong. I'm like, I should have seen the Pridwin by now. Duh.